here in Morgan State. It's not only a great day for football, but it's the Battle of the Beltway. Morgan State is taking on Howard. Not only is it a great day for football, it's also Morgan's final regular season game, which means it's senior day. So hopefully a lot of these seniors can finish their last college career game with a W. My name is Darius Brockett alongside my co-host Julian Johnson. The Morgan Show is on the road this week. We bring our cameras to Scope Arena in Norfolk, Virginia for the MEAC 2022 tournament where we see the Morgan State men's and women's basketball team. We got part two of the NBA X HBCU stream and I'm joined by my great friends Will and Malik. What's up guys? Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's Morgan State's homecoming, and so far they're playing a pretty, pretty slow game here against Norfolk State. Norfolk got out to a fast start, scoring in two plays and taking an early 7-0 lead. Morgan, however, was trying to get a counterpunch, but a fumble by star running back Alfonso Graham on the one-yard line changed the game completely. The Morgan State Lady Bears played two games at the MEAC basketball tournament at Scope Arena in Norfolk, Virginia. The first game was played Thursday against the South Carolina State Lady Bulldogs. The Bears convincingly won 66-53. This was in part to the return of Donye Red, who missed the previous six weeks due to a concussion. Coach Davis seemed to be thrilled to have a healthy team on the floor. Um, we do have a couple of key people back. Donye Red is back, and uh, we also have Taylor Hesson uh, back. Red scored seven points and obtained three rebounds. The Lady Bears were a defensive juggernaut coming up with 29 takeaways. Guard Jayla Atmore got her hands dirty, leading the team in steals with five. On the offensive end, Janaya Henson attacked the basket to make a living at the charity stripe. Henson shot 6 for 10 from the free throw line. Charlene Shepard has evolved to being a leader on the floor. Um, in, a, in a sense... I feel like I, with Ye out and then Taylor also out, but she's back now, uh, I had to really step up and be a leader, uh, show my experience that I've had on the collegiate level. With the 12 points from Charlene Shepard and Jayla Atmore, the Lady Bears rode the wave to a comfortable victory.